why I feel this way But every time I hear your name All my worries disappear, yeah It's all because of Welcome back to my channel for those of you who don't know me my name is Gugu and I'm also known as Sne underscore Guguletio on Instagram please feel free to follow me on Instagram because I really do drop some dope content welcome guys so today what we are doing is something that is long 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 overdue but because of finances of course i could not rush the process so today we are doing my bedroom reveal yay i have gotten so many questions on when are you showing us your bedroom and i'm finally finally doing it i'm super excited i said it's so much fun doing it after doing the living room and the kitchen i did take a good three months break two months break i'm not sure um i took a break saved up some money of course because it does not come cheap please 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 um don't skip those ads because i need <laughs> I need every cent I could get, please. So if an ad break comes up, just stand up and go and get your, get a coffee break, get a tea break, a bathroom break, make yourself a snack, but please don't skip the ads because they really, really do contribute to me bringing you guys this type of content because, you know, I'm not expensive, expensive, but I'm not cheap, cheap either. <laughs> Okay guys, enough blabbering from me. Let's get into the video. The first thing I want us to do, I want to show you my before, how I arrived at this apartment. The bedroom was empty. This is how it looks completely. It had nothing in it. And yeah, and so when you open the bedroom door, you get a mirror with a beautiful glass table actually this glass table was from mr price home it was not a glass table it was a study desk a glass study desk that i asked hubby to please help me uh turn it into some sort of a glass table because i wanted to make this little corner a beauty room but the table that i saw at home was too long and uh, this little wall in front of me is a uh, hundred and it's a hundred uh, centimeters. Yes, no, it's a yeah, it's a hundred centimeters. And then um, the table, this table that I saw at home that I wanted so badly that I saved up for, only to find out it is a hundred and thirty. Uh, centimeters so it was not going to fit and it was going to block the way and i really didn't want to walk in the bedroom and just go sideways because yeah i was going to be forcing things so i had to uh abort that mission but yeah so i came up with this idea to get this uh study table converted into a um into a beauty desk some type of or just a simple glass desk and then put up a mirror on top and then make it like a self-made um a beauty corner because i wanted to, when i'm doing my face my face i wanted to sit down in my room in my bedroom and do my makeup you all know that i love my makeup so much so i wanted to do that so but i had two options i had an option of putting a long mirror that i got from at home and then putting this lovely canary by the corner so this long mirror is from at home it was going for 4,800. Um, I'm going on the top of my head, but I'm gonna show you guys the prices. It was 4,800 bands. The mirror is 2.3 meters long. It is very long. And then the greenery is from Mr. Price. I bought it for 5.99. And uh, the vase is from Mr. It's at from at home. I got it for 4.99. So this was my first, first option of how I can make the room look. 
but I opted to go with the beauty room. The round mirror is from Mr. Price Home. Initially, it was gold. <laughs> And then I asked Habib, can you please turn it into black please because gold won't go. He bought a spray paint and did it for me. It came out beautiful. If I don't tell you that this mirror was gold, you will never, never know. Shout out to Bay. And then after that, he also took out that little desk thingy. Because I told him this was a desk from Mr. Price Home. Like a study desk where you can put your books and stuff not, not, and whatnot. So he took out that little corner and made it a simple uh, a table. I don't know the particular name. I'm just going to call it a glass table. But if you do know the name, please leave a comment below. And then after that, I placed it next to the mirror. We hung the mirror on the wall. And this is the end product. And then uh, the Ottomans, I got them from uh, Kailisha Home. Uh, they were gifted to me. Thank you so much, Kailisha. I will always plug you. Please go check out their page. This is their page. But I was gifted these two Ottomans. They come in a sort of two, but I only used one. So to make it a chair for like, um, to make it a chair in the beauty room and then i'm putting a simple simple uh, flower vase because i love fresh flowers you will see in this room there is so much greenery there are so many flowers it looks like a garden <laughs> it actually looks like a garden but um it brings me so much like greenery brings me so much peace so much calmness and that's what i want when i get in my room i don't want it to be too formal and stuff like that i want to relax lay down and enjoy my sanctuary uh and then i took my lv bag and used it as deco i did a video on this bag please go watch it on where i got it and how much i got it for i'm gonna leave the link up below please 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 go watch it it is a replica it's not a real bag when you get there don't get don't be disappointed you no know, it's nothing like that it's a luxury like replica it's a knockoff it's fake <laughs> so please go watch that but i did use it i found that it goes so well with the black and the legs on the ottoman are gold and the back is like a touch of gold so i placed it nice on the corner and then on the other side i placed my perfumes and then in the middle i used the flower vase um I didn't really have much time to apply decor but i felt like this works please let you know let me know if you like my little beauty corner in my bedroom and now let's move on to the next part the next part is my rug i got a gray dark gray charcoal mat which is 200 by 300 centimeters the i got it from superb list it was going for 4,000 rands and i waited until uh it was discounted they give us a 30 percent voucher and i used 30 percent so i paid for 2800 rents i really saved because 4k is a lot of money uh the mat is good quality i really really love it um i went for gray because i wanted to play around with my bedding so i wanted my curtains and my um and my rug to be very silent so i can like if i want to change my bedding then i can change it if i want to add florals then i can do that without having to worry it's going to clash with my mat or it's going to clash with my curtains so i was very strategic when it came to my colors and i like two toned things like i wouldn't put three different colors on something i could put three but i won't go to four so i really like color coordination <laughs> And my color coordination is very simple it's not complicated so that's why i got this mat and then moving on i got my side pedestals from belleville furniture some shop here in cape town they were going for 1800 rands for both of them i think one was no no i'm lying one was 1200 rands so i paid 2.6 for both of them uh, i love the black and white and the gold and the black finish it matches the entire room my entire room aesthetic really really love that and then i used my coffee table i took my coffee table books but i bought this new chanel book at exclusive books in canal walk it was going for 1400 i'm going to link it i'm not looking at prices i'm just remembering what's in the room i'm not i'm not even in the room but i'm just picturing it okay here 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 
I'm smart. <laughs> that time I'm so forgetful. Anyway, uh, I took that Chanel book and I also used my Vogue book. So the Chanel book is from Exclusive Books and then the Vogue book is from um, the Vogue book is from uh, Bargain Books. And then moving on, I got my lamps from uh, Woolies. They were going for 1,220 each. But I waited for, I waited for the 50% sale. I didn't get them. And then they went extra 20%. I got them for 600 rands each. So I bought both of them for 1,220 instead of 2,400. I saved. I was so happy. I was so happy. And then the light bulbs are so gorgeous. I got them from Mr. Price Home. One was 199 rands. And my bedding is also from Mr. Price Home. It was uh, 520. I made a mistake and I bought a king size. Can you believe it? I was so disappointed. But it seems to fit. It works just fine. But you know, almost you pay extra for king price instead of a queen. This is a queen bed. I got that and then uh, this lovely quilt I think that's what they call it quilt I got it from Mr. Price from for $7.99 love love it I love the texture it was the last one I'm like it wasn't it was even on the bed I'm like where can I find this on the shelves and they're like no it's the last one I'm like give me this one so I took it and then um my fur oh it's my favorite part. I also got it from Woolies on sale. It was going for 2,300 rands. Yes, and I got it for um, 1,200 rands. It was the 50% sale plus extra 20%. Score. I was so excited, guys. I was so happy. Like, I was literally screaming when I was paying for these things because I saved thousands of rands. And then I got that. And then those two pillowcases are from at home um it's continental pillows i got them from at home i don't remember the price i'm sorry but you can check them out they are egyptian cotton love them so much uh the bedding i love them i love the marble i initially had a white bedding but when i saw this marble table at mr price i'm like marble bedding bed cover i was like oh i'm getting this i was so excited i think it looks gorgeous i love everything marble it just makes this my space and i got that and the pillows, everything are from Mr. Price Home. I'm gonna leave a link here so you guys can go shop it if you like. And then I got this statue is actually in my bedroom. I just use this tier for to set up so that I can have a place to sit. It was going for 1,000, no, 1,999 rents. It was 2K and I had a 200 rents voucher, so I paid 1.8 for it at, at home. It is so beautiful, so unique. I love it. It fits beautiful. It fits in my living room. It also fits in my bedroom. Let's move on. So on the side of my bed pedestal, I got this nice vase from this local shop. I'm just going to put an eclipse so you guys can see the name. Um, I forgot it, but it's in our mall. And then I put this nice greenery from Four Walls. This shop has everything that I want from their lamps to their couches, but it's quite expensive. So if you ever at Canal Walk, it's right next to Mr. Price, you'll see it. I got the pot plant for a thousand rand nine nine nine. Love it so much. It looks gorgeous. And uh, so yeah that is all in the bedroom let's move on to my main bathroom bathroom or shower so when you walk in the first thing you see is my gorgeous gorgeous um uh what you call it uh laundry basket that i got from Moles. it was going for a thousand rands it is so beautiful i love it i want to get another one for the other room actually when i bought it i bought it for the guest bathroom but now i'm using it this side because no one uses the guest bathroom so i place it here and it fits in beautifully and above it is nice as a nice white towels i only use white towels in my bathroom so i got the towels from Woolies and i have some towels from mr price so i do mix um I love white towels like I only use white towels and then when you move on I put in some more greenery <laughs> I feel like it just comes the place um, the plant is from Mr. Price 
home it's not the highest quality but it came very affordable and it was the smallest thing i could find it was 3.99 and then the flower pot uh it was from woolies i bought it last year when i was still in Gauteng. and it was going for 3.99 also if i'm not mistaken around that prices but it was not more than 500 rands um and then when you move on my bathroom accessories we put our toothbrushes i got that from zara home that whole set uh the soap pump the um, um toothbrush holder and the little tray is from woolies not from zara home but those two things are from zara home uh i got them from 2.99 each love love them i just looked for them i once saw them at woolies ne? And I didn't buy them. I'm like, ah, they're always gonna be here. I'm gonna come back. When I eventually started doing my bathroom, they were sold out. So I had to order online. There's no Zara home in Cape Town. So I ordered online and they arrived quite quick. I think like in two days they were here. It was very quickly. So I got that from Zara Home and that little greenery I got it from um Woolies. I think it fits perfectly. I really went to minimal because it's a it's not big. The guest bathroom is quite big, but our main bathroom is quite small. So I was very minimum. I wanted a minimal but cute look, you know. Cute, not cute as per se, but um I don't know how to explain it. But I wanted something that felt that was simple yet beautiful that was that's what i was going for and then my bathroom rugs i love that they are black and white and i got them from mr price home they were going for 2.99 i felt like they were a bit pricey because everything else was like 200 199 but i love them i got them from mr price home and then when you open my shower you will see my uh, shower caddy i got that from mr price no i got that from at home living spaces i was going for 2.99 or 3.99 i am not sure if i find the price i'm definitely gonna link it for you and yeah that's how my bedroom looks so yeah guys we've come to the end of our video that is how my bedroom looks let me know if you like it where would you change um welcome to any suggestions that you guys might have if i miss something in the and um in the bedroom please please let me know i'm just sitting here and i'm naming things on on the top of my head like i'm just remembering so if i miss something ask me in the comment section and yeah i will reply thank you thank you so much for watching um i really had so much fun decorating this room and i even have more fun sharing ideas with you guys i have fun watching other people share their bedroom ideas on youtube i hope i've given you i've given you guys some tips on how you can decorate your bedroom and i've given you an idea or some sort of inspo on going forward on what you can do in your bedroom uh there's only one one place missing that's my bathroom reveal my guest bedroom there's nothing it's just a bed <laughs> i don't even know if i'm gonna decorate that but we'll see because i'm a chankura but uh the next video that's coming up will be uh, my guest bedroom deco <sighs> my guest bathroom deco really enjoyed uh decorating that it's almost done just one or two things one or two things yeah let me go guys thank you so much for joining me please if you haven't subscribed and you enjoy my content and you're coming back here for the second time third fourth please hit that subscribe button we're on our way to 20,000 subscribers please please make it possible for me and yeah i'm done look after yourself stay safe and remember that i love you guys so much thank you so much for the support i'm out I'm done. <laughs> Bye guys, I love you. Say that you will change the way you walk, the way you talk, the way you wear your hair. Change the way you dress, the way you kiss, everything cause you are scared that I'm